saw that Tammy does a toy of the month in her indoor playroom and I thought it was a wonderful idea. So I started implementing that here and every month I've been putting out a new toy or a new theme or a new area. Last month it was the cars and I just take all of that and put it right back into the basement so it can be recycled. So next year it could be a toy of the month as well. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys what this toy of the month is. And when we are done with this, I will just store this away and put it back in the basement so I can reuse it for another month. Rotating toys means that they last longer, the kids don't get bored of them, and the regulars who come in always have something to look forward to. This is the setup for May. I tried to make it as spring and happy as possible. We have these sorting bees, which I'm sure I will lose, but this is Velcro down, so hopefully they can't pull it up. We've got some matching flowers, an entire gardening kit, and an extra apron and gloves. So, so cute.